I would like to explain how the integration of external controllers work. And to create a configuration, we would have to go to the Gcon Manager application, then to the Control application. And if we would like to integrate ng-leveler with external controller, we would have to set up mode 1 or mode 2. And I will explain a difference in a minute. So right now I have this Behringer X-Touch configured in Maki mode. And I will add its MIDI ports to the Gcon Manager configuration. And I will set the protocol to Maki control. So right now, this Behringer X-Touch and ng Leveler are fully in sync. Now I will explain how to configure Yukon controller to work with ng Leveler. To create a configuration, you will have to go to the system preferences and go to Yukon preferences. Then you will have to drag and drop Gcon Manager application to this part of window and select protocol to Maki control. Then you will have to close Yukon preferences and most likely you will be notified that Yukon services will be restarted. Now when it is done you will have to create the Gcon configuration and to do so you will have to go to the Gcon manager application and go to control application. Then we'll have to select Euphonics MIDI ports. If those are not available most likely you will have to restart your workstation. So we select port 1 because we have just one controller over here and we'll set it up to Maki mode. And right now it is fully in sync with ng leveler. Now let's go one step further. If we would like to add second controller, it is enough to add more MIDI ports. So I'm adding right now this Behringer X-Touch to work with the Yukon controller. Now Behringer X-Touch controls next bag of channels of ng leveler. Now what is really important that you don't need DAW to use external controller with ng leveler. You just need your workstation to be powered on and you have to create your configuration. Now I would like to explain what is the difference between modes when it comes to the external controllers. As I've mentioned before, if you would like to use ng leveler with external controller, you would have to choose mode 1 or 2. In mode 1, your controller will exclusively control ng leveler. But in mode 2, your controller can be used to control ng leveler and DAW. To do so, you will have to create two virtual MIDI ports and assign those in the configuration. So right now, as you can see, I have this Behringer X-Touch configured in Huey mode. And additionally, I've added two virtual ports, which will communicate with DAW. Now I will start Pro Tools session and show you the configuration and how it works. So now the session is opened and I already have assigned virtual MIDI ports in controller configuration. Now this right panel is active and it can be used to control the AW. So all the buttons and controls which are not used by NG leveler can now be used with the AW. And now in Gcon Manager application, we can also select the AW toggle button, which will allow us to toggle between ng leveler faders and the AW faders. Yeah. 